More than 3,000 feet below this prairie landscape sits one of the best ore deposits in the world. More than 50 years ago, the first production shaft began its descent deep into the earth in Esterhazy, Saskatchewan. On June 8, 1962, they hit potash. Over the years, these deposits became Mosaic's K1 and K2 mines and are now touted as the world's largest potash operations. In 1985, the K2 mine experienced brine inflow. That's when salt water leaks into a mine from the water-bearing layers above the potash seam. Ingenuity and innovation helped Mosaic manage this common underground mining challenge for the past 30 years. Looking to the future, in 2009, Mosaic announced the first phase of its planned expansion program that included the first new production shaft in Saskatchewan in over 50 years. With a scope of developing the mine to produce 2.7 million ore tons with expandability. In 2015, Mosaic's board of directors approved a change in scope for the project, agreeing to accelerate the second phase of development. The additional development included an overland conveyor system to transport ore from K3 to the K2 and K1 mills, construction of a production head frame at the south shaft, and complete mine development. By accelerating the second phase, the mine can operate at its full design production capacity for delivering 6.3 million tons of product or 19 million ore tons per year. The accelerated construction plan moved up the time frame for a transition from underground mining operations at K1 and K2 to K3. That would eliminate the need for brine management and substantially lower cost per ton of potash. On February 16, 2017, K3 hit potash at 3,350 feet. The K3 mine and the K3 shaft as we hit potash today represents the future of K3 and it really is the vision and the fulfillment of the strategy and vision for the potash business unit here in Saskatchewan. From the get-go uh, we set a very high bar for safety. Um, tremendously important uh, the values of Mosaic uh, that each and every one of our employees go home safely. This is a challenging thing. You're working uh, for four and a half years sinking a 28-foot diameter hole 3,400 feet in the ground. Uh, a lot of activity. Uh, focus on safety has to be paramount every day. Uh, and we've executed extremely well on this project. It was great. Today's milestone at Esther Hazy K3 is a seminal event for Mosaic. This represents many decades of operation here in Saskatchewan. We believe that this will be the largest and most efficient potash mine in the world using state-of-the-art technology and to reach the potash zone layer is something that we should all feel very proud of. We have one of the lowest cost mines in the world and so for Mosaic it really represents a step in our strategy to take us to the next generation. Next Progress will move from vertical shaft sinking to horizontal mine development. First, cutting a pass between the two shafts. Much of the required infrastructure will be added to the shafts, including lowering equipment to be reassembled for mine development and future production. The people have had to be so attentive, so dedicated, and just hardworking. It's a tribute to all of our people. Thank you all for coming out to celebrate uh, you know, a real a major milestone on the K3 project. Well, I think this is a continuation of a very successful story that uh, Potash has been in this area. This is a uh, commitment by Mosaic to Estrasia in the province and the country to continue this success story. The K3 project really represents the next 50 years of Estrasia. It represents our final steps in mitigating the brine inflow risk and really setting ourselves up for one of the best potash mines in the world.